Today I am going to tell you how to take different dosages of Ozempic from a single pen. Now normally Ozempic comes in three different uh, pen devices. This is the 0.25 and this is the 0.5 milligrams and this is the one milligram. Each pen device is supposed to administer the same single dose. Normally, for example, if we look at the one milligram pen device, it is supposed to administer only the one milligram if you dial all the way to the end. As you can see, the one milligram comes here. However, due to the supply constraints, sometimes it is difficult to resource the different uh, strengths of pen devices. So I'm going to teach you how to take uh, different dosages from a single pen device. Now this is um, uh, possible uh, to take a lower dose from a higher strength device. Now this is a one milligram um, uh, Ozempic pen and from this we can actually give 0.25 as well as 0.5 milligram dose. In order to do so all you have to do is to first bring the zero to this initial mark which is for the test dose and from there onward you have to start counting the number of clicks because the total dose in this pen is one milligram which has been divided into 72 clicks so you can easily divide it into 0.25 by counting 18 clicks and 0.5 milligrams by counting 36 clicks let's go so i'm going to count each click and tell you where you will have the different dose strength. Let's start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Now, if you administer this much amount, you will get zero point. 25 milligram dose nineteen twenty twenty one twenty two 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. Now at 36 clicks, you are going to get 0 0.5 milligram dose. If you continue counting it will reach 72 to give you the one milligram 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 63 64 65 66 67 68 69 70 71 72 72 clicks mean 1 milligram, 36 clicks mean 0 0.5 milligrams, 18 clicks mean 0 0.25 milligrams. I hope that helps. Make sure you use a new needle for each dose administration. Thank you.